Hey guys, what's up? Happy New Year. I'm bringing you my fresh face for the new year. So welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. My name is Jillian and here on this channel I do um, a lot of home decor videos, thrifting videos, kind of showing you how to decorate on the cheaper side. Um, I'll throw in a vlog now and then, all while wearing no makeup. I thought I would start off the new year with a um, video about our renovated basement. You guys have been wanting a tour of our basement since we kind of renovated one of the rooms, made it uh, kind of like a movie room hangout for, um, for our daughter and her friends, which they have been utilizing it a lot. Um, so I am going to take you around the room and show you some of the stuff that I've purchased for the a room. The awesome table that a company sent me. This is not a sponsored video, don't worry. I'm not getting paid to do this video, don't worry. So, sorry about the hot mess, but I just wanted to hop on and say hello, first of all, and second of all, show you around this room. Um, and third, thank you for all the well wishes. I am recovering, I had surgery on December 12th. I am recovering. I did have a little hiccup in my recovery, so it's going slower than I'd like. So you have to forgive me for looking like this. <laughs> Usually I'm a hot mess, but at least I'm like do my hair a little bit. Like it's not this, but forgive me. I'm recovering from surgery. So anyways, let's get into the tour. If you can hear that, my dogs are upstairs running around. Now, before I start this, I want to actually flash a picture of what this room looked like before we did anything to it. Um, I have to say, I am very happy with how this room came out. I didn't think it was going to look like this, so I didn't really video it when it was just a bare basement. Sorry, honey. I didn't think it was going to come out this good. So I have a picture. I'll flash it on the screen now. So what you're going to see now is what it looks like today. Now, it's still a work in progress. I do um want to get a few things for the walls there's nothing on the walls and you'll notice that down here is going to be a little bit different than what i usually do um upstairs i'm very neutral upstairs there is neutral things down here but i kind of want to make it fun for our daughter and her friends so enough of that let's turn the camera around and i'll show you the room okay so i'm actually in our laundry area of the basement this room that we renovated is the second part of our basement so you kind of have to walk through this horrible laundry room to get to it, which we're going to be doing next. But um, we actually put curtains up. Sorry, it's dark, but I wanted to show you so that it's kind of separated. So my husband added this wall here to kind of make it feel like a room. And then we added a bunch of curtains over there. Now over here is still obviously a work in progress. These are some of Madison's toys, her keyboard, her clarinet, all that. So this whole entire wall was not here. It was not here. The door wasn't there. It was just open. It went into my husband's workshop area. Like you saw before, it was a basement. It's a basement. So he added the door, put a lock on it because that's his where his tools are and stuff. Um, this big blob right here is one of the bean bags that Madison got for Christmas from my parents. So she got two of them. She got that one. And then she got this one. They're gigantic. Um, they're kind of big for the space, <laughs> to be honest. They're huge, but they're amazing. And she loves them. And her cousin was here from Texas for a few weeks. And they literally slept down here. I only saw them like a few times. That They just slept down here and played down here and just did all the things. So they're amazing. And um, I don't know where she got them, to be honest. I want to say Amazon, but I'm not sure. So the walls were not here. Um, it was just concrete, like brick, not brick, like rock wall. Um, so I'm just going to pan around the room so you can see. I do have some Christmas lights up just because it looks cool at night for the kids. Yeah, I don't, <laughs> not really my decor style, but hey, it's a kid's room. Um, so I get a lot of questions about the floor. Now, there are indents here from when my parents were living with us and they had their leather chairs here. So if you don't know, this was kind of my parents' living space, living room with their big TV down here when they lived here, but they did move out. So unfortunately with this floor, the um, if you put something heavy on it, it'll leave an indent. This is just like, um, 
what is this? This is like gym mats, but they're, um, they look like wood flooring. So if I back up, like you wouldn't be able to tell that that's a gym mat. No one can tell unless they step on it. So we had to put something down here that would let the air through still. And my husband put like a thick layer of plastic underneath just so no mold or anything would, um, acquire. Um, so the floor is amazing. We got that on Amazon and the one thing that I don't like is the poles. Now these poles had to stay because they hold up the house. Well, you know, they're not the house, but you know what I mean? Um, they had to stay. So we painted them white and they're fine, whatever. Um, so all of the walls were not here. My husband did all the electrical. My husband is very handy and he's amazing. Um, there was horrible, um, like long, uh, I don't even know how to explain it, like office lighting. He put in these um, pocket lights. They're like recess lighting. So we put those in, and then we have a tiny window that he boxed out up there. Um, and yes, the ceiling is exposed, but he spray painted it all, cleaned it all. Um, it reminds me of a loft. You know what I mean? It, it reminds me of a loft, and, and I like the feeling. Um, I like the exposed brick over here. I think that's awesome. Um, so yeah, so about some of the furniture pieces this piece we actually got from a friend for free they were getting rid of it they got a new tv stand so i was like you know what we'll take it um and it was actually very nice of her she ended up giving it to us for free we are looking to get a new tv because let's be honest that looks like a computer screen and we want to move our daughter's video games down here and stuff so it works for now like it does what it needs to do but we're definitely on the hunt for a new tv a bigger one and then just uh, some of this stuff is our daughter's like her um strobe lights i'll show you what that looks like like when the lights are off and then her karaoke machine is down here she has some of her drawing books that's her laptop down there i got that light box sign at target and i just put happy new year and then some of her movies so i'm sure she'll fill that up as the time goes on um this couch is actually i was on the hunt for a um like a what do you, pull down couch like a bed so it lays it pulls down into a flat bed not the most comfortable but kids don't care um it's actually really cute and it was only like 75 or 100 bucks and it's in wonderful condition so i was like score we're gonna get this for the basement and it fit perfectly in this spot um the pillows are just the pillows i some pillows i had upstairs because i have so many pillows now clearly I need an end table because that is one of our like TV tables. Um, but for now it's just holding up a lamp. Um, and then I just have fun coasters on here. Tower of Terror, Space Mountain, Haunted Mansion, you know, Disney. I do want to get um, something Disney to go on the walls. I don't know what yet. Nothing too cheesy because I still want it to reflect my taste, but you know, something so the rug actually came from walmart it was like 18 bucks it serves this spot perfectly there's a dog I got this table from bonzi home they actually contacted me and wanted to know if i would like to pick out a table from their collection and i looked through the website and i was like you know what i don't do um collabs or anything usually with companies i do get companies asking if they could send me stuff and honestly i'm not just gonna take something to take something i will not i will say no if it's something that's ridiculous or i won't use or i don't need or something i don't want to share with you guys because it's just useless like no offense to these companies but that's not what we do here so when this company reached out to me i took a look at their website and um she gave me a few options on what i could pick there was a desk there was some end tables um, and I know that I wanted a coffee table for this space since we were redoing this space and I wanted to um, add a table here that was functional and still pretty because I like nice things. I don't want it to look like trash. So I found this coffee table and I love it. They did send me this for free. Like I said, this is not a sponsored video. They're not paying me to say anything about this table. But I do love it it's actually a really nice table and i am gonna leave the link down below for you guys it was actually really easy to put together my husband put it together for me and yeah i love the color i love that it's two levels now i wanted two levels because i wanted to be able to put blankets down at the bottom it gets really cold down here like i said it's a basement 
and it's winter in Massachusetts. For the most part, it's not like freezing, but the, you know, the walls are insulated and all that. But, you know, I wanted some blankets and I didn't just want them thrown everywhere, which is what kids tend to do. So I love that the bottom has a place to just fold up blankets and put. And then at the top, I just added, you know, one of my baskets with a candle. Obviously that candle is only lit when I'm down here. But I thought it would be a good place to corral like the remote control and all of that. So I love this table. I am going to add the link to it um, in the description box. If you want to check it out, feel free. I don't get paid if you click on the link. I don't get paid if you purchase something. Nothing. So it's just literally I wanted to um, review the table because I actually do love it. It came really quickly and... It was easy to put together and I think it's just a nice table. So thank you Bonzi Home for sending me this table. I really do love it. It's perfect for the space and I am gonna check out their end tables because like I said, that is not working for me. That is pretty much our whole downstairs. Like I said, two giant bean bags. They move them around and like put them where they want. But I did turn the lights on for you guys. Here, let me shut off the main light. Um. The lighting outside is kind of taking away from it, but it is a really fun, cozy space for the kids. And I know that once we get a bigger TV, my husband will probably escape down here when we're annoying. That him. is the tour of my refinished basement. I hope you guys enjoyed. I know it's not finished yet, but you kind of get the general idea. And um, don't forget to subscribe. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.